short video of uh, dyeing the sunroof. This is what I use. I use the uh, Sem color product. I uh, found that the uh, yeah, the best colors were whatever you could match. Uh, this one is called um, Portola Red. So uh, the white is just called Sailcloth White. And the blue, everybody keeps asking about the blue. Uh, the blue is just shadow blue. So yeah, Sem, good products. All right, so I've undone the uh, the nuts at the back here of the sunroof so that I can get access to the uh, stripes. I had vinyl on there before, so what I've done now is I've just taken it off. I'm going to place it back on. We're going to be dyeing the, uh, dyeing the sunroof, so I'm not worried about whether or not the, stri the stripes are going to go underneath because you can see the horrifyingly ugly <laughs> two years of vinyl graphics that were on it. Okay, it's gray already, so I'm gonna hit it with my uh, first uh, white uh, over all three stripes, uh, but first we're gonna mask off the car. Okay, so now I'm going to use just a standard, uh, you know, brown paper for the uh, masking off. And then you wanna use white uh, painter's tape. The reason I suggest white is because it doesn't leak as easily. Uh, I used uh, green painter's tape, and to be honest with you, uh, the white always held the bead much uh, stronger, so. All right, let's get this thing masked. and papered off uh, where I want to be able to have my stripes. I do want to make sure that most of these corners are pretty much tight so that you don't get any uh, dye in there. As you can see, we got a nice base coat going. You want to go light enough that you're not uh, getting it uh, too wet because you need a little bit of dry time in between. I found this product the first time I used it dried actually very quickly, so... It can be tough to get uh, it white underneath there, so I might have gone a little heavier than I might have liked. And uh, the nice thing is, um, once we actually go to do the red and the blue, uh, it should be pretty much fully cured. But uh, we're going to give it another 10 to 20 minutes to really ensure that it cures because we're going to be putting tape down uh, on top of the white that we just painted. See, we've got the red first coated, and I, uh, I went a little heavy, but I'm, like I said, kind of eager for this to get done tonight because it's like almost 11 o'clock and I'm tired. But the red's on, and uh, actually it looks pretty good. It's popping very nice, and that's only our first coat. All right, second coat is on, and I went too heavy. Oh well. You know what? I'm very impressed with this product. Sem definitely uh, dries really quick, so I think we're gonna get excellent color and, and it's gonna be done nice and quick, which is gonna be an all-time record for me. You know, the nice thing about doing these little videos is that Herbie is really great as a topic and as a theme. So it really makes this kind of project really fun because I know that, hey, no peeking. do three if you're a little bit uh, concerned that it's not gonna cut but yeah I think it's looking pretty darn good so yeah we're gonna take the uh, paper off in about 20 minutes and we'll see how it did no 
Okay. So this has been the uh, Sem uh, vinyl die. Very good products. That's it. We've got our stripes on. Well, now I got to clean up. <laughs>